Hello everybody, my name's Walker Magic and welcome to Observer. So, I think what this is, is it's a cyberpunk styled horror game set in a sort of neo-futuristic future. I just said future twice, but whatever. Um, well, the short description I said, or that I saw, it'll say cyberpunk future horror game where you hack into the minds of the insane. I mean, I, I don't know what it's about. Well, it's about that, but I don't know how it plays out. Though, I will say this is the second time I've tried to record this, because the first time it kept crashing because of my SLI. I had to disable that to get it past this. But it's playing, so we're there. That's the main thing. Come here, Lizarski. Yeah, we called Lizarski, are we? Uh, it's an incoming Lizarski. call. You there? Uh, interact with objects using the left mouse button. That is a odd looking device stuck to my Come arm. Here, okay, fine. I'll answer the call. Yeah. <coughs> you okay there? I've been hailing you for the past five minutes. I'm here. I'm fine. I must have dozed off. No rest for the wicked. How's the dream eater treating you? Well, I'm not in vegetable yet. Could have fooled me. Hardy har. Hardy har. I'm serious, Dan. Your signal's all over the place. Have you taken your meds? Uh. God, the sensitivity is horrid. Um. It's already quite low. I even, as you probably just saw, I tried to change the um settings on my mouse. Uh. Ah, oh, that'll do. Not yet. Do it now. I need you in good shape. If I must. Hey, right, press the middle mouse button to check the status and synchronize. And you synchronize. Okay. There you go. Daniel Lazarski. Citizen ID. Citizen class 8. October 19th, 2038. Gender A1. Okay. Occupation Observer. Yes. <laughs> Oh, that's built into me. Okay, interesting. There you go. Looking better already. If you say so. Yeah, wouldn't want me to mess up. <laughs> when you see the headlines, another leech goes berserk. Don't be like that. It's just... Yeah. Yeah, I get it. Any What's work? This about? Just checking in, or you need me down there? Give me some work. Nah, just a checkup. No one left for you to interrogate. Sounds That's a shame. Yep, not pretty. The explosion leveled half a block. The place is still on fire. Oh, okay. Goons all over the place, securing the area. Fun. Bring your tracks to me. Uh, wait, what? Careful what you say. This is a monitor channel. Okay. Who is this? How'd you get this frequency? Don't you recognize me? Adam? Yes. Well, what's left of me? Dad. Oh, God, it's our kid. Where okay. Where have you been all this time? Away from you. <laughs> it's funny. Thought it would be easier. Oh, uh, you're obviously Your wrong. After all these years. But it really isn't. Come on, Adam, don't start. I really thought I could pull it off. You know? It was so close. To making a difference. Yeah. To setting us all free. What were you trying to change? And now it's... It can't be for nothing. It might be. Tell me where you are. I'll come and get you. Shit. Dad. For once in your life, just listen to me. Whatever happens, I need you to remember. You're not in control. Adam. Yeah, I could have worked that out. You're still there. Adam. God damn it. Dad. <coughs> Dad. Matriarch, display caller ID. Displaying now. The fuck, matriarch. Kravinsky. 
Kabinsky. Is it? Matriarch, locate source of last call. Triangulating coordinates. Come on. Location established. Tenement building. <coughs> Class C district. Okay. Jesus. Adam, the stacks. You just had to hit bottom, huh? I guess. Alright, so. Rock fucking bottom. bottom. So, our son was trying to save us all. I don't exactly know what happened. I mean, I can try and make guesses at the very moment, but... I don't really know. So are we trying to find our son? Is that the whole premise of this? Uh, Rutger here as Daniel Lavorsky. Featuring the voices of Lynn Swanson, Brandon. Okay. That ran quite quick. Uh, once, it, well, once it's finished the opening credits, it'll be quite fun to actually get into this properly. Okay. Like, what is an observer? What is our job? I know I said we hack into people's minds, but what does that actually entail? Why are we doing this? Oh god, that poor kid. He just melted. And Okay, can I, can I actually get into the game yet? There we go. <coughs> okay. Let me play the game. So like I said, I have absolutely no idea what is actually going on. I, I, I don't know what any of that means. Oh, okay. Uh, well, we, we obviously see everything in digital, which could probably get very annoying. Uh, at some point, anyway. Hello, friend. What? What? Oh, is it because I got in your way? Oh, apparently so. Oh, hello. Hello, good sir. Easy there, Tin Man. I'm not looking for trouble. That's for sure. Tenant. Uh, yes. Um, sort of. Name. Uh, who are we actually looking for? Uh, Grabinski. Grabinski. Leon Grabinski. Tenant. Oh, apartment 7. Uh, oh, ground floor. Through the courtyard. Turn right, turn left. Straight ahead, turn right. Yeah, I got it. Backwards and forwards. Thanks. Mm. Door open. Uh, thank you. I mean, he seems a little out of it. Oh, is this... Where's my... Oh, this is where I get my case log. Okay. Uh, the janitor gave me the number of Adam's apartment. Heading there now. Like, is this actually a case? It seems more of a... Me kind of thing to do. Oh, middle mouse button to close. Okay. Wait, if this is how he sees all the time... I mean, do you mind? I'm trying to get to the door. Fucking cleaner. Cleaning robot, always getting in the way. Wait, is this how I actually see consistently? I mean, this is not something I would like to see all day. Uh, so in here, I guess? Okay. Oh, we're on ground floor. So... No point going up there. Can't go upstairs. So we go in here. What room did he say it was? 
I have forgotten. Shit. <coughs> uh, oh, apartment is seven. So, yeah, 117. And then it was... That doesn't sound too healthy. Uh, that way? Yeah. No. It was right, left, right, left? Right. Left, through a hole in the wall. Yeah, here we go. And the door's open. That's probably not not right. I mean, I'm just just saying. I mean, if the door isn't open, or if the door is actually open for me, that just screams something wrong, right? Oh. Is a dead guy. Adam? Is it Adam? Gone. Oh, okay. Ah, uh, what the heck is hurting us? Oh, he doesn't have a head. Okay, now I fully understand it. I guess not. So we are now locked into this room. Maybe it's not him. It doesn't have to be. Uh, I don't know. Operational efficiency restored. I mean, there's a chance at him. It's him. There's a chance it's this not. This is Lazarski six five six two one zero. Oh, setting up a crime scene. Okay, press E to activate electromagnetic vision. I need to check the victim's compass for connections. Okay. Um, there's a nice watch. What's that? Six million volts wasn't enough. Okay. Apparently not. Is that what I can get into? Hold the right mouse button to analyze the victim's compa compass. The victim is equipped with an ID mixer. Okay. Identification is not possible. Damn it. Not helpful. Probably not him then? HN. Gotta start somewhere. HN, okay. I guess it's something at least. Uh, press Q to activate biovision. Hold the right mouse button to analyze object. The head was removed post mortem. It's possible the killer took it. Motive unclear. Okay, so he was killed and then head taken. Under that. Erratic cutting pattern indicating the killer was in a frenzy. Alright. Uh, that's good, I guess. No, well, not really. ID check failed. Time of death about an hour ago before he called me. Well, 70 kilograms, 175 centimeters. Blood type error. Warning failed to extract forensic data. Okay. Can I. No? Oh, there's a lot of blood on the floor. Well, <laughs> that's not surprising, is it? Homo sapien, no match found. Contaminants detected. Failed to extract forensic data. Okay. So, we just go around detecting? Right, what is this? Controlled substance 45F, better known as feed. Feed. Never touched this ground. Okay. <coughs> uh, so that's bio. Let's look at that. What was the other button again? Ah, oh, it was that one. It was E. Oh, we've been Adam, deleted. So this is your apartment. Doesn't mean it's your body. That it doesn't. I mean, I think that's his dad. Or that's me, anyway. 
Anything of use? No? Okay. You never cared about this stuff. What is this stuff? Nothing. Oh, there's a chip in it. Hidden data storage. The encryption is too complex for my hacking tool. I'm taking it with me. Might be able to decode it later. Quite possibly. Very nice. Okay. Uh, what is my missions at the moment? So, found a headless corpse in the apartment. Might not be him. Can't be. I should search the apartment. Maybe I can find some clues. Uh, the lockdown triggered the apartment. Five auxiliary security system. My forensic night vision might help me find a way to deactivate it. And identify the cooler. Uh, compass was H. N. Uh, I need to find the woman who tried to contact the victim. Okay. So I need to do some hickory dickory with my fantastic night vision. Uh, nothing of interest. Yeah, no. Oh, I can actually open all four drawers. Okay. That's good to know. Uh, I'm gonna assume it, it's something to do with this. Collateral damage or evidence disposal? Very good question. Probably both. What is this? It's a processor. Uh, this is my data scanner thing, isn't it? My forensic scanner. Um. So, cables come in here. Bingo. Ah, noise. Uh, I I don't have a code. Okay. Can I do that? No. Okay, I need to find a passcode for it now. That's always fun. Uh, is there a code anywhere? Yeah, I've been completely shut in. Uh, which is fine. I'll find my way out eventually. Once I've figured out the code. 1984? Printed on real paper. An archaic for you, Adam. I mean, it might be 1984. Worth a try. Uh, 1984? Boom! Look at that! It's almost like it was obvious! Ooh! Okay. Hello! What the hell is that? I don't know. Uh, downtown Inferno. Tragic accident or insurgent attack? Uh, they know. Listen, I know you're a busy man and all, but we gotta talk. Now. I think they're on to me. Uh, for real this time. I'm almost certain someone followed me home yesterday. And today I saw this weird guy outside my window, just standing there. If you can't guarantee my safety, then I'm out. I got enough problems as, as it is. H-N. Okay. Complications. As far as our little mule goes, don't worry. I can manage her. She's just like us. She knows she's in over her head and it clearly terrifies her. You can't expect too much from a simple mind. For now, just focus on your work and leave the human relations aspect of our project to me. For the time being, calm down and maintain focus. Eyes on the prize. J. P.S. Glad you like the piece. I think it captures the essence of what we're trying to accomplish. Very nice. I'm going to assume that's maybe, um, uh, news article. Documents. Corrupted. Corrupted, corrupted. Okay. All corrupted. Programs. I've Open gate. The apartment security system. Leaving the crime scene. 
Good. Thank you for saying that out loud. What even is all of this? Can I do a scan on this thing? No? Uh, there's something in the co the wardrobe here. Wrong door. Uh, there we go. Yeah. Hello. What is this? It's a motherboard. Interesting. It's very old though, isn't it? And look at that heatsink. And there's a heatsink underneath it as well. Jeez, you don't see that nowadays. Alright. Onwards and upwards, I guess. This just doesn't feel right. You're still alive. No way. Alright. Uh, option. Interrogate the neighbours. Might be a good idea to interrogate the local tenants. They may give me some clues as to what happened to Adam. Can I turn this off? I, I would really like to turn something off. Turn this off? Is that like my objective? Um, it would be really nice if I could. Oh, has it sorted itself? Awesome. Oh, it's a communal bathroom. Or a Toilet, that is just disgusting on an entirely new level. Okay. I guess I'll start with this guy? Hi, this is Tom. And Irene! <laughs> we hope you're having a positively peachy day. Okay. Oh, we sure do. Sadly, we're not in right now. Okay. <laughs> but you can leave your message after the beep. And we'll get back to you as soon as we're home. Yay! Oh, I mean, beep! <laughs> um, kill me? Please? That was excruciatingly painful to watch. Okay. I mean, these are odd doors, if you ask me. Hey there. You there? What do you want? Got a minute, sir. KPD. Oh God, they're here. The cleaners are here. No. I'm, I'm not. I just, just come to say hi. I want to help find. I want my son. Please help. KPD, I need to talk to you. You broke it. No, you broke it. Nah. -uh. Will you get these? Kids? <laughs> I'm fucking talking here. Uh, this yeah, is uh, this is quite about? funny. Hello. Uh, tenant from you seven. Know the tenant in apartment seven. Dad, Tommy's picking on me. Shut up, snitch. I thought I told you to shut up. Seven, huh? Yeah, yeah. it's um. Can't say that I, I guess guy. it's one way of okay, so it's interacting with kids. Just yeah, shout well, at them. I've seen him once or twice. I might have a vague recollection. Could you give me a vague description? Maybe. What's it to you? Uh, he might be my son. Might have been staying in that apartment. I'm trying to find him. Well, why don't you tell me what he looks like? I'll let you know if it rings a bell. We lost touch. It's been a while. Huh. Sign of the times, I guess. See, mm. I'm a family man. Myself. Good for you. No, you shut up. Sounds like it. That's for sure. Yeah, I can tell. So, can you describe him or what? 
young, probably in his 20s. Medium height, medium build. He wasn't very memorable. Okay. Uh, shouting? Is everything all right in there? What? Oh, yeah. You know how kids are these days. Do I? Yeah, you gotta be strict with them. Or they'll just I guess. All over you. Usually, I just sit them down in front of the projectors. Keeps them nice and quiet. Yeah, I mean that's a that's, that's a good way of doing it. Just shove kids in front of TV. He usually gets them to shut it down. Shut, shut them up. Yeah. Any strangers skulking around? Nah, I don't pay much attention to the other tenants. Bunch of losers. A lot of pleasant. Dumb. Not as dumb as you are. Nah, you're way dumber. Shut the fuck up. Not upstanding citizens like you. Ooh. You bet your ass. Fucking burn, mate. Out of this dump soon. Is that right? Yep, I've been working my way up. I even filed for a status upgrade. Once that goes through, we'll be moving to a B class district in no time. Uh yes. sure. Good luck with that. I'm sure you will. I highly doubt it, but you can live in hope. No, nobody home. Can't let myself in. That's a shame. Why did I just walk into that? I don't know. Uh, what have we got? We got three. I mean, three and two. One, two, and three might be good ones to talk to. I need to ask you some questions. Do you know what's going on? My hollow projection got cut off. I can't get a signal. The building is under lockdown. No external connection. Not much we can do. Shit. Sounds serious. So, uh, you wanted to ask me something? Yes. Tenant in you know seven. Who lives in apartment seven. Seven? I didn't even know anyone lived there. Uh, hey, you wouldn't happen to know when they're going to fix the connection. Not that it's like super important to me or anything. I just need to know. Uh, I'm sure they'll fix it soon. I'm sure someone is already working on it. Oh, good. It's just that it feels weird to just sit here alone with my thoughts. You know, can you talk to me some more? It makes it kind of easier. The fuck keeps hitting me in the face? Oh, fucking pigeon. Uh, previous you lockdowns. Here long? Oh, well, I, uh, uh, it must have been at least seven or eight years. Ever had a lockdown before? Um, I don't think so. I don't remember my projector going off. Ever. Well, okay. What do you want to talk about? Um, yeah, he's, uh, he's yeah, obviously yeah, a bit of a shut-in. Uh, the Giant was fighting Killer Cromer today. You an AMA fan? Uh, not really. Sounds like you are. Of course I don't know who won since my projector went out. Can I move? Oh, that right bird is really getting annoying. Sorry, I don't have time for this. Oh, okay. Uh, I understand. It's no problem. I'll just sit here alone. God, I'm really starting to sweat like a pig. <laughs> oh, poor baby. I mean, you could always go out and make some friends. I mean, that's an option. KPD, I need to talk to you. Get away from me, man. I got a piece on me, and I ain't afraid to use it. Well, just no, being polite. Now calm down. I'm just looking for some answers. Oh, I know how you get your answers. I got nothing to tell you. I, uh, okay. I have no idea what you're talking about, but okay. Good talk there, mate. Hey, you there. Come here, quick. Oh, hello. What is it? What's up with the lockdown? Is it the phage? Was there an outbreak? Uh, I don't Too know. Early to tell. I'm looking into it right now. Looking into it? Are you out of your mind? We might all be infected. You're very cautious. Is stay calm and... and let them come to slaughter us? I won't let them take me. I won't. 
All right, well, I guess he's about to kill himself. No, and I can't let myself in. All right, <laughs> so we've got a few more doors to talk to. So we've done nine and 10. What's through here? 12 and 11. Nothing in there. Nope. Uh, okay, now where are we? And I can't go that way. And that's a door code. Middle mouse button to hack. Okay. Uh, do I just... Oh, I just have to wait. Okay. Cool. Oh, I just... Oh. I'm sorry. That wasn't nice. Yeah, okay. Oh. That was a little electric car. I only just noticed that. Nothing there. Nothing there. The door, please. Oh, hello. Just want to talk. Who are you? Did Chiron send you? I'm no. APD, if that's what you're asking. Seriously? We haven't had a cop around these parts in... Never, I guess. Well, you well, got one now. Got one. Oh, jeez. <laughs> yeah, good luck. Well... Great minds think alike, I guess. A new log update. Uh, oh, so I finished talking to everybody. Uh, okay. It's like a little, little radio controlled car, but whose is it? And why is this door unlocked? Uh, hello? Any DNA? I need to know if there's DNA. Voices from below. Don't believe their lives. The plague is still out there. Uh, my god, that's long. Undelivered mail notification. My dear Annie, by the time you read this, I will no longer be among the living. The details are not important. Just know that I went out on my own terms. Uh... I won't ask for a proper burial. God knows you don't owe me anything, but by the time the cleaners are done with the place, I doubt there'll be anything left of me to bury. Just know that, for all my faults, I have always loved you. Just like I loved your mother when the disease took her, a part of me died that day. Simple displays of affection become a foreign concept, a powerful reminder of what I had lost. It does not justify what I've put you through, but it is the truth. I am so happy you've managed to get out of this hellhole and find someone worthy of your love. I wish you both all the best. Love, Dad. No. Oh. oh, that's so sad. A fire and so what? Oh, it's it's a mini game. <laughs> okay, it's a game within a game. And okay, he's. Bloody spiders again! Okay, so I, I can collect coins apparently. Yeah, okay. You go around saving princesses. Level 2! I can't get to... Okay, so I only have two levels on this one. So I guess the rest of the level's going to be elsewhere. I guess. What's that? Remove your... Implant? Okay. 
Oh. What, what is that? So is that my? Ha yeah. Okay. Strain level decreased. So what happens if I let that just run out? Okay, thank you, Pigeon, for flying into my face. Janica left the door open. Yeah, did he now? Hey, there you are. You. <laughs> I remember. Good. Tenant ID. Keep records of your tenants. I need to match your name to an apartment. Register. Office. Authorized. Personal only. I'm a police officer. That's authorized enough. True. I know what you are. Oh, yeah? Uh, yeah? Back during war, took one alive. Sent for one. No few. Ah, the observer to get into his head. To get into his head. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not a threat. If you're worried I'm going to snap, don't be. They don't even let us carry guns anymore. <laughs> not worried. Past glory. Past most things. Okay. Yeah, you fought in the war. You fought in the big one. Is that why you got all this junk in you? Plasma sweep. Hit our convoy. Okay. Burrow through armor. Through armor. Sorry, I didn't mean to bring back memories. Yes. Memories. Uh, I don't trust this robot. I don't know why. He looks quite sinister. What can you tell me about the tenant in apartment 7? Uh, uh, tenant? Yeah, tenant. How long has he been living there? Yeah. Maybe longer. Not good with time. Alright. You ever talk to him? He's not much of um, a help at the moment, but it's better than nothing. None of them do. All right, Tin Man. Let me know if it comes back to you. Uh, lockdown. Something triggered the lockdown. Mm. Trying to get it open. Rudy and I. You think it might be the nanophage? You had any recent outbreaks? Nanophage? No. Last one. Long time ago. So a nanophage is obviously an infection of some kind. Does it infect people with implants? Certain type? Old? Rudy. Kid Rudy is the robot. Multifunction service and maintenance. Drone. Don't lose it. What? Mm. Wonders off. Sometimes. Mm. Need to track manually. Yeah, sounds like a robot. Can we lift the lockdown from the inside somehow? Or get a message out? No. Keep people in. Isolate, accommodate, alleviate. Okay. So... You yeah, all know how that last one used to work. We seem to have... We're essentially fucked at the moment until we can sort something out. Anyway. How about you show me that register now? Tenant. Name. Uh. All I have are initials. H N. H N. Uh, match. Two entries. Elena Novak. Apartment. One o four. Four. Hana. Neither. Uh, neither one, one or six. six. Okay. Thanks. I might need to see the register later. Can I use your office? You can. Office. Unlocked. Don't make a mess. This guy is quite helpful. 
I'm gonna go nose around, and you give me access to the rest of the building. Uh, uh -huh. uh, assistance. Unstable. Unlocked. What I could. Yeah, thank you, sir. Thanks. Sorry, I didn't even get your name. I'm Dan. Oh, name. Janice. Like a Roman yeah. god. Janus works. <laughs> you know. Good to meet you, Janus. Stay out of trouble. Out. Out. Yeah, I think we do. Sir, you go. Oh, I hit crouch. Lol. He did leave his door open. Yeah, there we go. These are some badass fucking microphones. He's got a right old little um recording studio going on here. All he needs now is just well, I suppose he's got a PC. He can make his own let's plays. He might put us all out of business. Uh Kwaski Janus Private E2 Yeah uh, the wall stands tall Request denial Uh greatly appreciate your exemplary service and the sacrifices you have made for your country. The VRI policy enforces a strict proactive Stance on helping our brave veterans reintegrate with society. Regular coverage requires a deed of permit, B-class employment, presented to our representative on an annual basis. Your current janitorial position simply does not qualify. Given these circumstances, we must sadly deny your claim and therefore force to terminate your participation in the program effective immediately. As of today, the Veteran Pension Fund will no longer cover period, periodic maintenance of your cybernetic prosthetics. We wish you all the best. The Veteran Rehabilitation Initiative. This is an automated message. Please do not reply. Alright, so he just got fucked over by the government. That's fine. Alright, this has gone long. This has gone long enough. Veteran or not, I don't give a crap anymore. One more message and I'll find you and beat the fucking junk out of you. My mother can no longer take this shit. She's sick of telling you over and over that her husband, my father, died 18 years ago. She's moved on. We all have. No one wants to live in the past to constantly relieve a relive a tragedy. So, for the last time, Mike Jorowski is dead. He's been dead for a long time. Have someone type that into that busted ass head of yours. I don't care how you do it, just fucking remember this time. Even if it's a toss-up between this and remembering when to take a dump. Because the next message you send her will earn you a broken fucking jaw. Consider this your final warning. Wow. Poor bloke. This is quite sad. Bogdan Jaworski. There's someone here actually with the last name as him living here. Nathan Hoffman. Uh, okay, so we need to go up to the first floor. Storage space. There's a, living, there's a couple people living up top. Okay. First floor. Here, look. Spider game. We get level three. Okay. Boom. Okay. Smush both of them, then I can just. I just have to kite this guy around, don't I? Boom! So eat! Yeah! The fire seems to work! Menu! And there we go. Uh, and log out. Okay. Turn the fan on. Nanophage and I. Be nice to know what the nanophage is. 
Alright, so we need to go up a floor, right? Question is, where's the, la the ladder? Staircase! There we go. It's just a lot of video cameras and garbage around, isn't there? And okay. I mean, at least the shadow works. Um, who am I looking for again? Uh, 104 and 106. Okay. Um, 104, I guess that way. Obviously not. What is going on in there? Oh, he's fallen over. Fuck's sake, Rudy. Uh, guess I need to go and get Rudy in a minute. 105 and 110. Oh, yeah, this is 105 to 110. Okay. okay what's in here? Oh, what? No, what was that? Oh, I think it's that going down. Okay. Alright, I mean, this isn't a pleasant bathroom. And I'm so. Oh, what? Uh, excuse me? How did you get up? You were stuck on the floor a moment ago. I mean, I appreciate the help, like. Oh, that is... No, why did I look at that? I mean, I do appreciate the help, but you were stuck not being able to stand up. God, I mean, this is a horrid place to live. Right, what? That's 107. What is it? 104 and 106, right? Yeah. Well, there's 106, 105. And a landing. Okay. Well, since I'm here, I might as well talk to 106. Miss Nader, <coughs> I'm with the KPD. Mind if I ask you a few questions? Mrs. Excuse yeah, me. La -da -da -da. Mrs. Nader. All right. Uh, Mrs. Mrs. Nader. Nader. What do you want? The, the, um... This intercom thing is quite interesting. That you only see parts of their face. Like, either the eye, the mouth... Ma'am, is everything alright in there? It's, um, an interesting way of doing it. You tell me, officer. I heard the alarms go off. Are the cleaners on their way? Are any of us safe? You might be. seems to be a malfunction. I don't think we're looking at an outbreak here. Well, I'm sure the other tenants will be glad to hear that. That they will. But not you? No, officer. Not me. Why? Have you made any calls in the last hour? No, I have not. Could you check your compass for connections? Somebody may have used it as a proxy. I don't have a compass. No compass. No compass. I thought pretty much everyone had one at this point. Oh, you thought wrong. I don't have any implants of any kind. So she thinks she's better than everyone else. If you don't mind my asking, do you live alone? Yes, I do mind, and yes, I live alone. No spouse or daughter. Didn't you hear me? I said it was just me. 
Okay. Then why did you insist on being called Mrs? I'm a widow. My wife died many years ago in the plague. Hmm. Okay. Sorry to hear that. Is that why you don't have any implants? Yes. Want to see the scar tissue on my face and neck? It's quite an embroidery. The little monsters really outdid themselves. Or do I have to show you what's left of my arm? Would that satisfy your curiosity? This woman's a Mrs. bit Mayor, of a bitch. I'm just doing my job. Huh. Yes, I've heard that one before. When the cleaners took my Laura away. Well, I mean, if she had an infection... Oh. said precisely that. I never saw her again. Not even the body. It's like she never existed. Yeah, but if it's an infectious disease, then... Yeah, get off your fucking eye horse. Respect, ma'am. You're not the only one who lost someone to the Fade. God knows I have no love for tyrants. But they're an easy target. Is this when you tell me how we're all to blame? Pretty much. That's not what I... That we brought it upon ourselves. Man. That we deserved the phage? Deserved to see our loved ones die? Didn't we? We jumped at the opportunity to meddle with our bodies, but we didn't ask ourselves what the price would be. He's got a fair point. Very inspiring, officer. And very hypocritical. Spare me the lecture. I will not be judged by some corporate goon. I wish you a good night. So long, Mrs. Nadia. All right. Elena, no back to you. All right. So we need to find room one hundred and four. So, what is it? That's seven into it. Yeah. So, I go. I guess outside, out to the left. Maybe. I mean, that's a very convenient tattoo shop. What the hell was that? Something was banging on a door. Um, why is there no door here? I was expecting a door. But, okay. 101 to 104. There we go. Hey, you! I can hear you out there. Help me, please. You? What do you want? What's wrong, sir? Oh, I heard this awful noise. What's going on? There's been a lockdown. A lockdown? No. Oh, God, please, not today. What's wrong with today? Well, what's so special about today? I was scheduled to undergo a, a medical procedure. It's a private matter. I'd, I'd, I'd rather not talk about it. A dick enlargement! <laughs> I didn't mean anything. Yeah, okay. I didn't say anything. Sounds like you're in pain. Is well, he, though? It's fine. I'm just... I got a, a condition. I, I'm waiting to have it fixed. Okay. Anything I can do? <laughs> sure, if you're an expert in corrective surgery. Maybe. You so never know you until I give it a try. Lately. I haven't seen anything in over 40 years. Oh, you're uh, blind. That's your condition. I, I, I really don't feel comfortable talking about it. Fine, I won't waste your time then. Hey, wait, I did hear something. Yeah? Quiet footsteps, deliberate, heavy breathing, angry, not hiding. Hunting. Hunting. Okay. Hmm. Anything else? The smell. It seemed uh, oddly familiar. Reminded me of my childhood. Your childhood? Mm, yes. Okay. My family lived outside the city with all manner of creatures. When it would rain, the smell would be similar. Okay. Interesting. So, that is quite interesting. Uh, everything's making noise at me. It's not very nice. I, oh, the door is unlocked. And open. 
I guess they're expecting me? But we'll find out next episode. Yeah, that we will. Alright, so it's interesting so far. Yeah, we've got those two different modes. We're trying to find our son. There's a headless body, which is always not very nice. Yeah. So, we'll continue into 104 next episode. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed. And, as always, I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye. <laughs>